Hey everybody, welcome back to Bob Key TV, stage three to Laguna Seca in the books at the Tour of California. Uh, and your stage winner, Tom Squeets, in a absolutely spectacular, <laughs> unlikely, <laughs> very surprising, successful breakaway in the finale. Uh, and if you don't try and you're not a sprinter, you don't win. Um, Sean Bennett and Squeens did exactly that. And to be honest, they took advantage of some very dastardly bad luck to Fernando Gaviria, who flatted with just five Ks to go when the field was in full cry. And because the quick step team turned off the chase, the breakaway had a chance to survive. And then there was one other element. Peter Sagan most certainly could have chased down the breakaway, but Caleb Ewan was able to make the front group selection at the very end, a steep climb that tops out just over two Ks to go. Peter Sagan took a look around, the riders left, decided, no way. <laughs> He's towing Caleb Ewan to the line and uh, they just ran out of teammates. I'm a little bit surprised that Adam Yates and Rafael Mica. Uh, Adam Yates, teammates with Caleb Ewan, Rafael Micah, teammates with Peter Sagan, did not go to the front, neutralize a breakaway, and give those two guys a chance to duke it out for the finish. Um, so Caleb Ewan winning the field sprint for third. So Peter Sagan, very clever, giving the breakaway another chance to stay away. And <laughs> miraculously, Tom Squeens gets the stage win. And by the way, considering what happened to him last year, absolutely delightful to see him back on the top step of the podium. Third stage win for the Trek Segafredo man. Great riding by Squeens. GC doesn't change, but that will change 100% tomorrow with the individual time trial. 21 miles. This is going to be a big one. Stay tuned.